Hi, I'm here with Sharon, and we're on the Healthmark Sport Vibe 1000. Sharon, this is a vertical vibration machine. It has a one millimeter amplitude. The amplitude is the amount of travel from the base up and down. And we can adjust the frequency or the speeds that it goes through. So we're going to start off, we're going to do some leg exercises. So I'm going to power on the machine for you. We'll get it set here. We'll start it off on the first speed setting. I'm going to increase it to the third speed setting. All right. I'm going to step back out of your way. You're going to grab the handles and you're just going to get a nice comfortable position with your knees, <coughs> knees soft. We're just going to let everything loosen up before we get started. All right. All right. Now let's raise up to our toes. Very good. And we're going to hold it for just a second. And we're going to come back down. Now let's bring our feet closer together. And let's go up on our toes once more. And as you can see, when you, when you go up on your toes from a wide, wide stance, you have a wider base, so it's easier to do. And so when we bring the legs together, it's a closer stance, and it requires a little bit more balance, so we're working a little bit harder. All right, now let's come back down, flat foot. There we go, we'll let everything shake out. Let's spread our legs a little bit. All right, now let's come down softly into a soft squat. You never want to go further than your knees will allow you to go. And right now we're working the top of the legs, which is the quadriceps. Quadriceps, foreheaded muscle on the top of the leg. We're going to go down a little bit further, and we can engage the hamstrings and the glutes. Mm -hmm. The hamstrings are on the back of the leg, and of course we all know what the glutes are. <laughs> all right, let's stand up. All right, and let's go back down to the squat. Let's stop here for a short count. Down a little further, and we'll come back up. And you can either hold these positions, or you can go in slow repetitions like we just did. Now let's take your left leg and let's step off the back of the machine. There we go. And then just sink into that lunge and stretch out the hamstrings on the back leg. We're stretching out the calf muscle. We're stretching out the hamstrings. We're stretching out the glutes. On the front leg, working the quadriceps and we're working the calves. Actually, we're working the core. The core, a lot of people, they think of the core, they just think the abdomen. Right. The core is from your ankles to your sternum. So we're doing some core workout as well. Yeah. Now let's come back up. All right, and obviously everything you do with one leg, remember you always need to do with the other leg. Let's just spread our legs now, and let's just relax. Excellent. <laughs> okay, this time we're going to incorporate a little bit of cardio into our leg exercises. So we're going to go from lunges to knees up to get the heart rate up so we can burn calories while we tone the muscles, okay? All right. All right, so let's get the machine started. I'm going to give you a setting of five this time. Okay. So this will be stepping on and off the machine and it really help to get the heart rate up, okay? Okay. All right, so I'd like you to grab your handles. Okay, I want you to step back with your left leg into a lunge position, put it back onto the floor. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna come from that position, bring your knee up as high as you can to your chest, pause briefly, and go back down to that start position. That is your start position. Okay, so let's get started. Bring it up, back down, Bring it up, back down. Now bring both feet flat up on the platform. Now we're going to alternate and work the other leg. Okay. So we're going to do the same thing with the other side. Go down to your start position. And now knee up to the chest, back down. Knee up to the chest, back down. Come back flat footed for me. Now this time we're going to alternate legs. We're going to go down and up, come flat to the platform, down and up. That way we're alternating sides, okay? Yes, so let's get started. Left leg on the floor, knee up, back down, second leg down, knee up, back down one more time, knee up, back down, knee up, back down, and we've just done some weighted cardio resistance exercises. Awesome. And now building upon the exercises that I just showed you where we work the upper body, we can continue to work the upper body work the core, but engage those muscles further by some simple leg movements, some leg raises. And that way we can also work the hamstrings, the quads, and the glutes as well. So we'll get back into our push-up position. I'm going to come midway down, and I'm going to raise a leg as, far as, I, as high as I can take it, squeezing the glutes. I can rep it out. And what this actually does is while I'm working the affected leg, as I switch, I'm also working the quadricep muscles 
of the leg that stays in contact with the floor. Now we can do the same thing from the plank position. Once again, assume the plank position. Start with the leg raise, working the glutes and the hamstring for the raised leg, and the quadriceps of the leg that's on the floor. The core is more thoroughly engaged, and as you see, we can get a full body workout with some simple floor exercises on the sport vibe. And now I've hooked my tension straps to the Health Mart sport vibe. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to combine some lower body movements, basically your standard squat, with some upper body movements and simultaneously work my shoulders, my legs, my core, and my arms. I'm going to power on the machine here. I'm going to give myself a setting, speed setting of seven. Got my straps, I'm going to mount the machine. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit a mid-squat position, about right here, and I'm going to press up on the straps. This is providing a lot of tension and I can feel it in my glutes and my hamstrings, my quads, even down in my ankles as I push up against the tension. Now from the same position, I'm going to work my middle delts by simply rotating outwards and pulling up, shift around to the front delts, pulling up, come up out of my squat slightly, and hit a modified bicep curl. All the time working my lower body and squeezing in some upper body work as well. 